Hi everybody, my name is Matt Elliott. I'm with Garrity RV Super Centers here in Junction City, Oregon. Today to show you a really cool trailer. This one's an ultralight. It's something that you can pull with a lot of different rigs and it'll park in a lot of places, which there's a lot of freedom in that. Uh, this is a Coachman Freedom Express 192 RBS. There's a lot to tell about it. I think we should start inside, follow me. So the trick about this trailer is, a lot of times people come to me and they want something that's very small and towable. They want to get something they can pull behind a V6 pickup or maybe one of these smaller crossover SUVs. And they still want, guess what, a queen walk around bed. They still want a slide out. They still want an oven. They still want all the bigger things, a big refrigerator that, that they're used to seeing in a bigger RV. And there's this conflict of priorities. They want more stuff inside and they want lighter weight and size outside. It's, it's almost impossible. Possible. but this trailer does a really good job of it um, first thing I'll point out is that we do have the full-size queen walk around bed right here so you don't have to crawl over each other to get in and out of bed no elbow fights it works great we also have right over here a small slide out now the one choice we do need to make is we're going to have a couch or we're going to have a dining area because you're just not going to fit both of them into a trailer this small unless you get rid of the bedroom. So something's got to give. These guys went with a couch that has a nice seating area with a fold down armrest. And by the way, this is a lighted cup holder right here with USB charging it. They're really smart. They figured out a way to give you a chair that will charge your phone. So you can sit in here and charge your phone, watch TV, whatever you want to do. Up here we see that we do have a home theater system and it's pointed right at the seating area but this also will come out and articulate so you can see it from the bed and it has a home theater system here to run all your stuff so this will do DVDs and CDs but it'll also do Bluetooth it'll take a USB thumb drive and auxiliary connector so there are a lot of ways to get your audio and your other things into this system and have the TV as well to watch so you know it's a it's a dynamite feature now right here you see that we have a very nice comprehensive galley they've got a new stove that I really love you can see here we got a glass stove top and the thing that's really cool about this is it's going to be a flush mount so when I'm not cooking I've got more counter space and it works really simply I don't have to worry about people reefing on it the old metal ones you'd see all the time were bent because people would reef on them instead of picking them up and doing stuff this works really great also this has a beautiful little oven there it is and it's even got a glass top so you can look through the front and see what's going on in there here's a great feature right here it's got a drawer that's designed to go around the plumbing for the sink and now we have silverware everybody wants to know where they're going to put their silverware and their spoons and their their pancakes spatulas and mixers this is where that stuff goes you don't have to worry about it at all it's got a massive deep sink so you can clean your dishes or whatever you want to clean lots of room there we've also got a very very nice overhead cabinet area here and you've got cabinet storage and hanging storage all around the front even over the couch there and the slide out and of course here's your microwave and your hood vent and you get you got great ventilation in this trailer it's not a big trailer so it's really easy to, to uh, you know exchange the air out and keep it fresh it's also very easy to heat this or cool it down it does have a nice air conditioner on it as well now this trailer also has more storage back here so we can put a lot of stuff in here and you have a full-size refrigerator most ultralight trailers just have a small single door fridge sometimes they're as small as three cubic feet this is a nice big one with a big deep freezer place to put your milk jug right there there's a lot of space now take a look at the bathroom this is a nice bathroom with a skylight so it's well lit has a medicine cabinet so you have a place to put all your stuff and it's got a porcelain toilet the porcelain toilet doesn't sound like that big a deal but I'll tell you they're a lot nicer because they're a lot easier to clean than the plastic ones so go yay for porcelain toilets all right let's take a look around the exterior and I'll show you more follow me okay so now one thing you see up here is we have a, a full power awning you just hit a button and it comes right out you've also got outside speakers so if you want to set up social area out here and have music you can certainly do that now this one here has a tandem axle and some of the ultralight rigs only have one axle those are really lightweight 
but they're a little too light for some people because most folks would rather have two axles for safety. If you get a flat tire on this one, you still got three more tires. It's a good idea. Now also right here, this little clip here, this is for a portable solar panel. So you can buy a solar panel that'll plug into the side of your trailer and recharge your batteries during the day while you're out playing and doing other things. It's a great idea. This, I'll have to come back to that. This area in the front is very important because this is the weather end of the trailer. This is the part of the trailer that beats into the wind. And you see a lot of trailers that don't have any kind of enclosure in the front. So you have a lot of seams and a lot of weather exposure. And that's where sometimes you get a, a, a problem, construction problem called delamination. This one here, this is an all enclosed, we call this a three quarter cap. And this is gonna weather very well. It's also really aerodynamic. It isn't likely to develop a leak or any kind of delamination in the front because of this front enclosure. It's also got a nice diamond plate rock guard on the front that really cuts down on the chances that you know your vehicle behind is gonna be throwing up rocks and damaging the front of your rig. We take a look here. It comes with the power tongue jack, so you can operate that easily and get your rig up and down and mounted to your tow vehicle excellent. If you buy this one from us, by the way, it does come with two batteries and a lot of other stuff. You know, here at Garrity, what we do is very comprehensive. It's designed to make sure that when you leave our place, you can go to a campground and start using your trailer. So, I want to point out down here, we have stabilizer jacks on all four corners. Very easy to use. And here's your slide out. And then right here, a few, few quick notes on this part here. You've got an outside shower so you can clean up out here. It's always close, good to have that close to your sewer station in case you need to wash your hands. Also, it's got a sewer flush. After I dump my black water tank, I can use this flush to double clean it out and make sure that I don't have any kind of uh, uh, residual things in there. Helps keep odors and, and servicing to a minimum. That's a very, very good idea. Oh yeah, one other thing. This has the removable shore cord, and a lot of people don't know why you'd want that, but I'll tell you what's nice, there's no hole in the side of your trailer for a little mouse to crawl up the cord and get in. I really like a removable shore cord because it's gonna keep the mice out. Okay, so that's a quick look at the 192 RBS from uh, Coachman. It's a Freedom Express line. And again, very lightweight, very uh, compact, and very well equipped and very well built. I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, give me a call. My name's Matt Elliott. My number is 541-954-8495. You have a great day.